So the police force today, its primary role is to keep um, social, economic, and racial order, right? So when people step out of place, um, then the police comes to work, right? So I think that's why police violence exists in Brazil, is that Brazilians, um, Black Brazilians specifically, um, need to be constantly kind of controlled um, and kept in a particular kind of order and kept in their place and their space. The everyday terror and fear and killing and brutality, um, you know, whether it be getting people off the sidewalk, uh, you know, the killing of street children, is also deeply tied to forced removals, right? So you terrorize communities into a certain kind of degradation that then is tied to their eventual removal to the distant periphery of cities. So when part of the everyday police work is to one, produce fear so that you do not act out of place, right? Two is you, you, know, you actually enact violence on the body um, so that there's a constant kind of punishment um, and a reminder that you're not human, right? So the dehumanization work um, that's involved in everyday police work is absolutely um, key and crucial. But then also that there's a constant reminder that black life is not valuable, right? So that you are not seen as the primary life to be protected in society. In a modernizing space, um, in a new, fresh, revitalized city like Rio, Sao Paulo, Salvador, in a revitalized country like Brazil that's you know, um, preoccupied with progress and advancement, that these folks are not valued or seen as part of the future of the country.